agenda of this video is the operation cycle what is the impact on operation cycle it's completely on again it's an automotive right we have a different operation cycle on different uh, domains so here we are going to see about the automotive how the operation mode or operation cycle carries before that if you are not subscribed to the channel please do subscribe and here I have given uh, the two things the information I have to give one is we crossed 10k subscribers yes it's really thanks a lot for your support and uh, for that yes we'll uh, try to make the video on the rededc information maybe in another one or two video it will be on the complete uh, rededc information the one video so please please do subscribe and uh, hit a uh, you know the bell icon for the immediate notification anytime the particular video may be remote but definitely we'll get you the notification and yes definitely you will not miss it all right and here we have the join button so i already spoke about this join button in the previous videos just youtube has brought this join button to for their revenue as well as to support creators like us okay so here uh, we have uh, so many uh, months ago these join buttons has been enabled and uh, i am not recommending that uh, to go for more like support if you really can able to support yes you can go for 300 299 or uh, 199 or 159 or 89 or 59 or if you're really interested to contribute yes you can go for 59 also there is no compulsion 100 percent it's it's up to you and yes so we have already so many members are uh, contributing this so but we have not uh, so far delivering anything just for them and uh, maybe who are is about to join uh, future for them uh, we are planning to make at least four videos so average on four to six videos in a month only for the members and it will really helpful you know what in what way so we are trying to uh, gather filter out the very hardcore um, uh, articles that is a uh, research papers so that uh, you can just up to you just uh, can uh, come to know or you can understand about uh, how the the advancement is going on say for example autosar autosar is a one research paper it has published on 2007 but nowadays it's 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 uh, it's been developed and it's been um, you know uh, used in in the practical life so similarly we have human in life that is 2000 uh, uh, 10 sorry 2020 this paper has been published and add as car sensor like the 2020 papers are there so mostly we'll we'll try to take uh, the papers of 2015 or above after that all right so for example let me show you one thing see Ada, i'll just give you the auto sir i'll show you so that you can understand so we'll what we will do is whoever has joined in this particular membership you can uh, you can just come to know what exactly um, the thing is like you can just uh, you'll have the feel that how you have um, gone through the articles like you don't want to filter that is our job is to filter and uh, give it to you so you can just get some information so on the journals like even for those journals we have to pay like uh, Elsevier or Springer or IEEE uh, even uh, Google Scholar right see we have it is on 2007 in 2007 uh, when 2006 only they have started to author author authoring and uh, 2007 has been accepted and published so this is all about the autos are see in 2007 whatever the architecture we are learning and we are working now uh, it has been uh, clearly explained as with the root on uh, 2007 only so like this we'll take two to three uh, sorry four to f uh, six papers per month so who are can you know if they want to join and they can just this get benefit see similarly we have the adas so adas and all in adas there is some improvement so this is on one second yeah 2020 and uh, adas so in adas what are the improvements so these are all quite interesting and you don't want to go uh, and filter out anything so it's we are just uh, taking some 30 to 40 papers and we are trying to filter as much as we can to deliver you the utmost good content i'll just show you so this these and all the papers that we are going to uh, discuss see, in our upcoming videos for the members all right so this is for yeah, human in loop also i'll show you that is that will also be interesting let me show you the human in loop see we now we are working on the hardware in the loop so now the 2021 see uh, i think it is on um feb or march has been published so this is this is human in the loop so human in the, because we know we are all dealing with autonomous car so in autonomous car how the human in the loop works okay so that is all about so it's quite interesting things to uh, know and uh, learn so that's what we'll try to 
deliver you as much as good content and for that for this subscription you don't want to contact any of uh, the number or anything so you can just click on the youtube join button and you can give the details that's it okay so it's there again there is no compulsion on that if you really wish or if you're really interested yes you can go ahead all right so let me continue the video yes what exactly the operation cycle is see this is the time between so we can have operation cycle we have we can have a different meaning so we have to understand so there is not like a single meaning for this operation cycle say operation cycle means the time between ignition on off so you are turning on the ignition remember you are not turning on the engine so turning on the ignition and turning off is a operation cycle is considered as an operation cycle the time between engine on and off okay you're turning on the ignition after that you are trying to turn on the ignition uh, that is engine so ignition through uh, engine through ignition so that is all about the engine on on off that is the operation cycle then again time between event occurs that also operation cycle so event occurs means what see event is a common term see even the ignition is a one event engine on off is also another event so that's what they have been splitted so ignition on off is a on operation cycle engine on off also on operation cycle event occurs also on, on off so for example if you go for the autos or in autos are you will be considered as an event so what exactly the event they mean that we'll discuss in the next slide and currently you just get a you know, clear picture on ignition and engine so in some projects you are dealing with the in ignition uh, you know if there is some uh, infotainment cluster so for that the, your ignition is a operation cycle in some project in a part range project your powertrain means it is all about the engine engine and the transmission system so there your operation cycle will be engine not ignition so you have to categorize which project you are and what is your objective so if you know about because in the in the infotainment is nowhere uh, you know dependent on the uh, engine so it is not like if I engine starts, I will start. It's not like that. Okay. Um, it is for the Papa cluster. It's uh, it is more than enough to get the ignition. Okay. So cluster means I am talking about the infotainment. So even in the cluster, it includes the engine modules also, safety modules also for those in, uh, engine on off uh, is required. But if you go for purely ign uh, you know uh, infotainment, then engine ignition on off. Again, engine on off is for the powertrain projects and even so that's what what autos are it is autos are you know it's architecture for the generic architecture they have given so for the, they have mentioned event even there is so those specific uh, and particular in the event so what exactly it is let's see see impact on operation cycle or impact impact of operation cycle. okay so the operation cycle is a measure or the cost between any event so that's what say for example now i'm starting this video i'm starting this tutorial so this is the 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 video that or, or the um, tutorial it starts is a one event so i'm starting is the one event there is major event i'm talking i'm discussing many contents so that's that's different so i'm starting is a major event again i'm stopping so maybe it may be some eight minutes or nine minutes so that is another event so the event okay so that is that is called operation cycle it's a measure of or a cause between any event okay so there is a between there is the time gap right so that's what operation cycle is a a reference for most of the occurrence in system like engine or motor or any machines okay this operation cycle is not only for the automotive as i mentioned even in aerospace there's uh, operation cycle even industrial application has the operation cycle so again if you understand it's a start and end so it's very simple right so operation cycle you can tell is start and stop but it's you have to be more specific because nowadays people are expecting that so you have to be very specific in your answer if you just tell start and stop no that's that's not acceptable you have to clearly demonstrate or you have to clearly tell that what exactly it is okay so automotive system or the ECU so now we came so these two uh, I think these two points is a generic and here automotive system or the ECU deals with the operation cycle is a reference for engine or ignition on off so this is again automotive the system level I'm telling okay so this is there is no software has been just you can just um, see even ECU also kind of hardware and automotive system so it's a system level in the name itself you can understand the system level so here the engine on off or the ignition on off is a operation cycle coming to autosar his autosar is completely about the software right there is no hardware is a dependent but the major part is software it's the architecture so the software architecture describes the operation cycle with respect to DEM that is diagnostics event manager so usually used to call as a DEM so in autosar DEM is a uh, one module which deals about 
event so here what is the event exactly do you ever think see here even the first layer in the first layer only i have given the uh, hint right ignition engine event these are all the three things even here also ignition i have mentioned engine i have mentioned and here's the event so the, this event is all impact with the autos are so do you really know what exactly the event is and how this event will impact so if you really know you can leave a comment and my next video i'll talk more about event events in autos or that is diagnostics event manager all right so that's what dem we used to call it as and don't miss the next video on dem you will get a more knowledge on what exactly the dem is all right if you're not subscribed to this channel please do subscribe share to your friends and we'll get back to you in the next video until then bye take care